I like using frozen brine shrimp. Welcome to another episode of Cooking for Dummies with me, Chef Vic. Preparing fine meals isn't only for humans. In today's episode, I will show you how to prepare fine cuisine meals for your pets. Let's get started. First, I will show you how to prepare a fine cuisine meal for your cat. What you do is you get the bag of cat food, open it up like this, and they come with a, a spoon or a measuring cup, which is perfect. You want to scoop just enough to fill the cup of dry food. As you can see, it's in the cup. And we're going to take the dish, the cat dish, a freshly cleaned cat dish, and we're going to put it in there like so. The next step is to take the dish of cat food and to gently place it on his eating area next to where he drinks his water. The next meal I'm going to prepare is for tropical fish. Now tropical fish like a whole wide variety of food. I like using frozen brine shrimp. They come in a packet like this. Just slide it out and you punch out the cube of frozen shrimp. Place it on the dish. They also like dried flakes. I'm gonna open up the can of dried flakes, sprinkle just enough. Now this is a serving for four tropical fish. They're blood parrots. Blood parrots love frozen brine shrimp and flakes. Look at that. What fish would turn down a meal like this? So now that I've prepared the frozen brine shrimp with the flakes, I'm gonna now proceed to feed the blood parrots. You can tell they're getting excited because they know it's time to eat. So I'm gonna put the brine shrimp on a fork and just gently put it in the water. And you'll see them coming to the surface to eat the brine shrimp because it's a very delicious, nutritionist, and healthy cuisine. Now the flakes, put them on the fork. Now the fork is a little moist from the water, which makes the flakes stick to the fork easily. And just dip the fork and you'll see the flakes floating throughout the water in between the frozen brine shrimp, as you can see. They're very happy. Okay, we are now ready to prepare a nice meal for birds. Now, birds love seeds. I like to mix seeds with bread. Now, you could take any old bread, sliced bread. I like to use an English muffin because English muffin have those little seeds that birds love. It could be stale bread, doesn't matter, any kind of bread. What you have to do, though, is break it up into little pieces because birds have small beaks and they can't eat whole pieces of bread. So crumble it up nice, put it in a nice serving dish, and get a spoon, a tablespoon I prefer, and scoop up a tablespoon of bird seed. Now this particular uh, bird seed you could buy anywhere from Home Depot, Lowe's, PetSmart, Petco. This has a whole variety of different type of seeds, and uh, birds love a variety of seeds. And just carefully, Sprinkle the seeds over the bread. And there you have it, ready to go. Let's go feed the birds. Once the birds get a whiff of this, they'll all be around like an Alfred Hitchcock movie. Well, there you have it, folks. Three beautiful, easily prepared meals for your pets. Tune in next week when I'll be preparing a meal for a guinea pig, a dog, and a hamster. Here on Cooking for Dummies with me, Chef Vic.